Okay, you angels need to watch for the transformation in about 30 seconds time. I do not look like this for the majority of the vlog, but um, this is the real me, so hey boo, welcome to another vlog. Um, okay, just before this video actually gets into things, um, I wanted to explain it quickly because this was not really a planned video. Basically, I had every intention of vlogging on the days that I picked this camera up, but it didn't turn out like that. And so this is kind of like a huge compilation of vlog footage that I've kind of gathered over the last week or so. Yeah, it is a lot of vlog footage. Um, we have a lot of fun stuff going on. There's a date night with me and Connor. There's Herbie's first trip to the vets. Um, there's like a mini TK Maxx haul. And then there's also a really fun sister day trip towards the end of the video, which is my favourite part of the vlog. So I don't know, if you get bored, like skip to the end because that's what the real fun is, I personally think. That's kind of where this vlog is going to go. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, IOYSM, thanks for clicking on this video, boo. Oh, there's also a house update as well, which I think you guys will be interested in. But now that's kind of like really outdated. Like I filmed that maybe like five days ago and... um. Oh, a lot has gone on. A lot has gone on. I can't wait for you guys to see Sunday's video because that's like a lot more real time, if you know what I mean. But I'm going to sit back, relax. So should you. Go grab a cup of tea. Um, enjoy the video. Love you guys so much. Bye. Boo, listen, I just thought the angels would want to see tonight, okay? I've got my pink coat on. Angels, I'm sticking up for you. I'm the one that, to tell Eddie to vlog today. And she's like, nah, I'm not going to vlog tonight. I said I wasn't going to vlog tonight because this is our special date night. Oh my god, raise the alarm. I feel like I'm in a Beyonce video with that red light on me. Yeah, angels, hello. Welcome back to another vlog. Welcome to the weekend vlog, actually. This is going to be the start of something special. Right now, me and Connor are on the way into Bath. We have actually really, really kindly been invited to our favourite restaurant in the entire world, Absurd Bird. Basically had a mini meltdown when I um, got the DM, didn't we? Yeah, we were like, oh my DM god. MG. We've been there so many times before. They invited us to go there tonight, so I'm really excited for our date night. Actually, haven't been on like a proper date in what feels like forever. Forever. Like this feels special, guys. Like, okay, hang on a minute. We're oh. going to Absurd Bird, and I'm. I mean, I'm going to show you guys what I'm wearing when we get there. But I'm wearing a massive pink coat, and Connor's wearing a shirt. Do you know what I mean? And slicked back hair, like... I never wear my hair like this. This is when you know... It's a special occasion. It's a special occasion. It's what happens when you become parents, guys. So, yeah, it's Friday night. It's 20 past six. We're going out for some nice dins. If you guys haven't heard of Upside Bird before, oh, my God. It's actually... Yeah. Oh, it's just so It's like southern fried chicken. Is it's it like, southern fried chicken or fried chicken? Mm, fried I don't chicken, even know. isn't it? All I know is it's probably not the place for this coat. But we're rocking it anyway. Coming up on the right here, everybody, on Ellie's grand tour of Bath. Um, my favourite view. Oh, wow. That is just so gorgeous. I kind of feel like you have to be here to appreciate it. But the Abbey looks stunning. It's really nice in the sun because you can see all the buildings. Just arrived and just ordered our food. We've got a lot. Guys. Like an extreme amount, an absurd amount. Oh. Oh, good punk on, good punk. A lot of people come up to me and say they like my coat or my punk. I do like your coat. It is like wearing a duvet. It's like Herbie's there, but he's not. I miss him already. What up in the clouds, oh my, since I met you. Ooh. Get it, boo. Oh, Get it. Oh my god. We're going to talk you through what we have because, um, yeah, just what we go all in, right? Well, I don't actually know what you've got here. I've got a cheese fondue con, and then can I just tell everybody this? These are deep fried baby bells. Yep. And then on there we've got a waffle. That's a cheese fondue. We've got um, a chicken wing. Over here we've got chicken wings to share. One has some mash and gravy, and you also have a burger. How is the burger? Have you tried it? Oh my gosh, con taste test. Come on. Oh, I'm not live on camera. Come on, live on camera, boo. You got it. Food challenge. Yeah? Good. Herbie, are they the new pillows I've literally just bought? Good morning, everybody. It's now Saturday morning. Um, I'm looking a bit flustered because I've literally just got back from. <sighs> the boys are just. I've literally just got back from a big shop at B&M and Home Bargains and TK Maxx and Pets at Home. Um, I've literally just walked through the door and I want to show Connor and Herbie what I bought because I got so much stuff. Like, you guys are literally going to die. The first thing I bought 
is Herbie's first Halloween outfit. Look, this is yours. You're going to be a pumpkin. How do you feel about that? Oh, yeah, so happy. So this is from B&M. I got him a size medium. Come on, let's put it on him. Ready? Dad, do it for you. Oh, wow. It's so exciting. Sit. Good boy. Good boy. Is it not the other way around? Or is it that way around? No, it's that way around, isn't it? Stand oh up. Oh my! He's too big for it. <laughs> Literally. Oh, <laughs> wow. wow! Cool boy! Look at you, Harvey! Cool outfit! Come on, Herb, stay me! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Oh, you look so handsome, Harvey. <laughs> oh, little pumpkin running about. Oh. Happy oh. say, Happy Halloween, angels. Trick or treat. Say, Trick or treat, everybody. Happy October, guys. And then here's some more bits I got for Herbie. I got him this puppy dental kit. This is going to be a good idea just to get him used to sort of like cleaning his mouth and having good oral hygiene. I also got you. Uh -oh. <gasps> Look that? at this, Herbie. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, tough guy. That's a cool one. Yeah. That was £15, but I have no regrets. How much is it? 15 Worth it. Also, for his mouth, I got him some, uh, like, fresh breath stuff, which you add to their water. Can anybody tell me if this brand or this product is actually any good? Like, it's 11 weeks old at the moment, and you start using this when they're 12 weeks old. So if it's not any good or if it's, like, not good for them, I'm sure it will be good for them because otherwise they wouldn't be allowed to sell the product. But um, I have a week before we're going to start using it with him anyway. But, yeah, you just add this to their water and apparently it's just supposed to sort of break down daily plaque and give them nice fresh breath and then to go with that i also got him um like a gel that you put on their teeth so you don't actually brush their teeth but you just put this gel in the mouth where they are licking the gel it's supposed to get all around their teeth so if anybody's ever tried these products for their puppy let me know how you think it went obviously like when he's an adult we're gonna get different products but i think this is pretty good just to start him off with i also picked him up some new treats i got these ones the wainwrights ones for puppies from 2 to 18 months and i really like the ingredients on them so if you guys have seen my puppy haul you'll know um i did loads of research into the food that we were going to be giving him so when i was at one of the local pet shops around um it's a pet shop called pets corner which is in melksham for those of you that are local i was basically like talked through all of the different ingredients that are on dog food dog ingredients whatever um and i learned a lot about the sort of different ingredients and a few people have been asking what we have her be on so currently we have him on the green acres puppy food so then when we were picking out the treats um obviously the ingredients for that is really important as well so definitely a good bunch of ingredients so hopefully he's gonna find those yummy as well and then i also picked him up a christmas jumper hubby Herbie, look, Christmas jumper, oh my goodness. So this was in Pets at Home, and I think this was like maybe £10. I got my size small, but honey, I think you're going to be a bit bigger than a small. I thought this was really cute because it's like autumnal. It's not majorly Christmassy. Obviously, I'm not going to get him to like walk around all the time in jumpers, but maybe just like a picture or something. And then I also picked up some chocolate biscuits for myself from Home Bargains because hashtag necessities. Then I just got these two pillows for our sofa from B&M. They were £7.99 each. Um, I picked up this decorative glass jar from home bargains i've seen these so many times in there and i always wondered what i'd put in there and where i put it but guys i have so many house updates to show you in this video like seriously um some of you would have probably seen them on my instagram stories but we have our new console table in our living room which that is going to go perfectly on with some of these inside oh my goodness like i am that house that has chocolate everywhere like for guests you know these are just some crunchy milk chocolates i think they're a little bit like um ferrero rochers or something the whole thing was 9.99 i'm gonna put them in there 
and put them on the console table which i'll show you guys in a minute i also got some nice new hot chocolate from tk maxx i got the wittards ones and here you've got luxury hot chocolate luxury white hot chocolate oh my god excited salted caramel flavor and i'm really excited about that i did also get this brand of hot chocolate because i just thought it sounded so nice marshmallow swell hot chocolate thank you very much by silly cow farms and that was 4.99 and i also just picked up these pajamas because i thought they were pretty cute pink and stripy can't really go wrong top is just like a night shirt and then you've just got the matching pajama bottoms as well there herbie look your christmas jumper Christmas jumper. Well, it's an autumn jumper. You want to give it a go, Herb? You want to have a look what it's about? Yeah. Wow, funky Come dude. Come on then. Come on. <gasps> <laughs> wow, look at you and your jumper. Mum feels all emotional, Herbie. Hello, welcome to our house. Would you like a chocolate? Yes, please. Really nice bit much though do you know what i mean like i shoved it all in in one go but really i could have done with definitely two oh, or yeah, three i'll do one not bad for being my little boy over there oh they're not b and m they're tk max mate b and m that's cute bit i like that so guys this is our new console table and the arrangement on it is not done final. like i don't want anybody thinking this is done it's because not it's final. totally not it's um i really want a mirror put up on the wall there so when my um personal handyman kind of decides to do that you know that would be great it's actually from wayfair i will put the link in the description box but i do think they've sold out at the moment unfortunately and then wall art i think is going to go up on that wall there i'm going to get a nice big rug to go here still and then i think i'm going to put the ladder in that corner there but I'm not sure. I'm going to have kind of um, a big sort of revamp of everything this weekend and get the place sorted. OMG, also, our dining table and chairs have arrived. Oh my goodness, how nice. There are these two chairs as well to put up, but they are just like not screwing together properly. They would obviously go there. I thought it might be a nice feature instead because they're just not working apparently. Is to have like a really nice big dining bench there with like a faux fur top. What do you guys think? I love this dining table and chair set so much. I'll put the link for this in the description box as well because it wasn't even that expensive, like, considering you get all the chairs. Um, this table is honestly so much bigger than our last one. Like, I would say our last one kind of came up to about here and it was also a lot less wide as well. So I really, really, really like it so much. So that's this room. I'm gonna move the floor lamp that is in the living room into that corner there, I think. Um, get that mirror put up on the wall. And then I'm also thinking like maybe three mirrors like that. I think that would look really nice or some wall art, I'm not sure. And then coming upstairs, I am so happy and proud to announce everybody, we finally have a bed. Please ignore how it actually looks at the moment. Like, this is clearly not what our bed is going to be looking like. This week, I'm going to be sorting out, like, a new bedding set. And I'm going to order some bedside tables. I just wanted to wait until the bed had actually arrived. So that I kind of knew exactly what colour it was going to be. And what colour scheme I wanted to go for in here. So, my bed... Okay, oh my god, you guys are literally going to die when I tell you what I'm about to tell you. Seeing as we had so many issues with the bed in our last apartment. Um, if you guys didn't know... Obviously, we didn't have any furniture when we first moved into our apartment. And so then we had one of my dad's old beds. Like, my dad has, has loads of furniture. And we had just had one of his old beds um, for a couple of months. And then I ordered a, uh, like, crushed velvet grey kind of like diamante bed from ebay that was like 200 pounds um it was like the worst quality bed that we've ever had in our entire life well yeah like it was just rubbish i think we actually even got a replacement sent out but that was equally as bad we were just basically sleeping on the floor the whole time like so this time i really wanted to make sure that we got a really nice high quality bed because a lot of the stuff i'm buying for this house i'm kind of seeing it as like you know furniture that's going to be lasting us for a few years rather than just doing it cheaply like I did in the apartment last time. But, you guys, beds are expensive. Let me just tell you that right now. So I was finding it really hard to find like a nice bed that I really loved the decor of, whilst not having to spend like thousands of pounds on a nice bed. So luckily, a company called Arista Living came into my life and I, guys, like I actually can't even tell you I love them so much. Arista Living, I think is so cool because I've never seen anything like it in my life. You basically go on their website and they have a, bed designer and you decide the size bed you want you decide the type of storage of the bed you want or like the frame of it so we have an ottoman 
storage or is it extra storage i'm not sure so you can lift up the bed like that and it has storage underneath and you decide the color they have like black white light gray which is the color we went for dark gray and then a brown i think they might have a couple of others and then you also pick your headboard and there's a few different really nice headboards to choose from it feels really expensive obviously king size ottoman storage and what was the other thing oh yeah this was the headboard that we went for risa living have actually given you guys 50% off until halloween the night of halloween 31st of october um where you can get 50% off I know, 50% off beds. And I just think that's so cool because you can design your own bed. I don't even think they're that expensive to begin with anyway. Yeah, so I've just created our exact bed on the website. And this one cost 584, split into half. So say that's 600. You get this bed for basically 300 pounds and free delivery. And this one would arrive on 23rd of October, which isn't even, that's like next week, oh my god. So I just think that's a really, really great website and company if anybody is ever looking to buy a bed. Like I said, you only have my 50% off code until the end of October. So let me know if you purchase. I would love to know what you guys actually go for. Good morning, angels, from a very wet and rainy and not a very nice day here in the Southwest. Um, the Swift family are big day. Big morning. getting ready for a very big morning for this little guy. Hello, are you alright? Do you think he knows Con? No, he doesn't know, does he? No. So, Herbie has his second vaccinations today. Um, excuse me, sir, how do you feel about that? Do you care to comment? Oh, silent treatment. <sighs> wow. So, yeah, today is the day. We've all been looking forward to. I'm really excited to see how he's going to be at the vets, actually. He loves being around other people and other dogs. Mm. So hopefully he'll see it as, like, a positive. An adventure. Yeah. If anybody has a puppy and they have any tips on how to make the puppy like the car, please share because we suffer. Apparently, you just have to keep doing it. Keep doing it and then mm. get over it. Con has to sit in the passenger seat and hold Herbie in his lap. And I have to drive because... Herbie's more comfortable in the car on your lap, isn't mm. he? If he's on mine, I don't know what it is. I think it's maybe because you're like bigger and so he feels a little bit more secure. More when he's on my lap, he's like, oh my God, you get me over to dad. Yeah, it's like 9.45 um, on a Monday morning. Our appointment is in 15 minutes, so we gotta go. Herbie, prepare for a big day full of lots of love and cuddles and treats. And the vets are gonna love you. You've got to shine bright like a diamond, little angel boy. first. <gasps> oh my goodness, what is dad actually doing, Herbie? Not the pumpkin outfit. Uh oh, Herbie. <laughs> Excuse me. Thank you. And now. <gasps> oh, Con, even every time he puts collar on, I just feel all emotional. Look at you, you just look so handsome. <gasps> uh oh, not chewing the lead guys this is the first time he's ever had a lead on him oh. we should have known this is what he was gonna do with it con oh yeah oh. a walking chew toy that's yeah. so fun oh he's never done this before has no. he? no oh. <gasps> oh my goodness here we go Herbie. yes <laughs> here it is Herbie, your first friend's trip yeah. <laughs> hello you're big on you <laughs> So He's got 11 weeks. <laughs> very handsome. Oh, told you you'd like it, Herbie. Yeah. Yes, what have I got over here? <gasps> Try that. Oh, yum. Good boy, Herbie. Oh, is that nice? Is that nice? Good boy. If you're really good, you can have one on the way out. Oh, <gasps> better behave. Oh, I'm sure you'll have one with you in there as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> driver's seat get out of the driver's seat Herbie you're driving home are you yeah Herb's driving us home yeah Herb. get McDonald's on the way Herb oh. he was a good boy oh, Herbie a good was boy, what a good boy Got all your bits that you need we've signed up to the puppy party oh, lucky boy yeah. lucky boy aren't you now you get to go home and play all day Herbie all day long. And all the angels say, good job, Herbie. So ours is filling up with petrol, and literally straight away, Herbie's in the driver's seat, chilling. Feel a bit more comfortable over there, don't you, Herbs? Your own seat of luxury. Heated pads a lot, isn't it? <laughs> that side eye of truth. 
Goodbye, Goodbye, my gorgeous little boy. And man. And man. Goodbye, boys. I'm off on a fun sister day trip. Here she is, here's my ride. Hey, boo. Wow, you're looking glam, sis. Keeping me waiting, boo. You know I don't like that. Sorry. In trouble with the queen. Sis, I'm loving your scarf so Thanks, much. That's really nice. Thank you. So, good morning, Angel Day. We are going on a sister date, sister shopping trip. I'm <laughs> so excited. We've just dropped Jessie off at my other sister's, Sophie, who has baby Rosie. Um, I don't think you guys have ever seen Sophie before, but she is coming to the cinema with us later to watch A Star Is Born, so you'll probably see her then. We're heading to Bath today, right? That's where we're going. Yeah, boo. I'm very excited. It's been a very long time since the three of us have hung out and obviously Sis, the Queenie without the kids. Time. So Ellie Ellie loves me without the kids. Can I just <laughs> Sis, say that? I love you always, but you know, sometimes it's great to have my BFF sis back rather than my mother of my nephews back. We're gonna just head into Bath, have a look around the shops and probably get some food. And my outfit today is my um long brown coat which is from NAKD and I think my 15% discount code is still working for that so I will link that below. Um, my pink crop jumper, my mum jeans which I wear basically every single day of my life and then just some white Nikes. And then we have Katie in the back. Hello. Do you want to talk us through what you're wearing sis? Sis you know I love to do that. Yeah. And I post fashion photos on Instagram. Oh, get so it boo. my pink fleece on from Primark. You love that so much. Yeah. Um, this pink jumper. Yeah. Look. Yeah. And Primark jeans. Yeah. And then just like got these shoes your vans on. yeah which are from primark as well aren't they yeah and then sis is looking very stylish as well in her outfit look thank very you. actually very autumnal sis i did notice the leather oh, leggings they look really you. nice katie all the angels have been so, so excited to have you um on the channel again <laughs> what do you think about being in the vlogs sis i love being in the vlogs do you yeah oh what are you demanding me to do now? Sis, I'm not I'm demanding doing you all to do these anything. jobs, everybody posting on Instagram for her, sorting out her work. But you know I'm so busy. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know I'm so busy, sis. <laughs> Can I be honest with everyone? Yeah. Oh my yeah, god, I want what? to do it. I don't know shop. if I'm feeling Primark today. Sis, I'm totally not feeling Primark. Oh, thank God. Sis, I'm literally no Primark's way. Primark's like a trip on its own. It's right? just like. Do you know what? And I'm over Primark shopping trips for like a few couple of weeks at least now. I've been in there a lot recently. So it's totally agree. It's very I'm draining. thinking like, why don't we go to like some really cute bath shops that we never go in? Well, I'm thinking Topshop. Oh yeah, sis. Oh, Topshop and Bride and H&M. Um, can I just say Topshop has actually been refurbished. Yeah, I know. Old girl probably went in there. No, no. Old girl went in there a few weeks ago, <laughs> actually. <laughs> on a Saturday with the boys and oh my god. Good lord sis. I don't recommend it sis. They were absolute nightmare. Jesse actually smashed his bottle in Topshop. <gasps> sis. Stop. It was very stressful. Jordan ended up I can taking literally them imagine out. right now. Yeah and we I can Jordan literally imagine. Bowed, we will never taking the boys shopping ever again. Good vlogging sis. I've still got five pounds to go on my gift card. Oh, oh gift yeah. Cards. Oh that's Primark. So sorry guys but <laughs> you have to go to Primark. <gasps> <laughs> oh my god, sis. Maybe okay, Ellie sis. can wait outside. I'll pop in there with you. How about that? Yeah. We can go to the, I don't know, accessories bit. Yeah. yeah. Or the pajama. I don't mind a quick pop in. Quick. Yeah. Ten we, minutes. We'll go in there for you, sis, but not for very long. Lucy's putting something on the radio. Shut your eyes, everyone. <laughs> Good shutting your so eyes, she's sis. She's telling us to shut our eyes. Hugh Jackman's a real great guy. He's such a great guy. He actually guy. uploaded a tweet the other day, sis, which made me laugh so much. It was like, when people say you don't look like you're 50 and then you see a picture of yourself sleeping, it's literally so funny. <laughs> Honestly, I'm going to put a screenshot up, but it's hilarious. That's I'm so going to show funny. you as well. Not only is he hugely talented, he's funny. He's a funny guy. He's really great and he co-starred along our 
our he favorite did, night. He so did. He did. She obviously, you know, has links. From now on, ready for the drop. And we will come back home. Home. Home again. And we will come back home. And we will come back home. Home. So we have arrived. Sis is in charge of where we go for lunch today. Not that we're going to be going for a couple more hours. Kit Kat, tell everyone your top three spots where you want to go for um, lunch. TGI, Bills, but I don't know the third choice. There's TGI's, Bills, so, and don't know the third choice. Okay, let's see if Sis is up for it. Sis, guess what idea we've just had. Oh my God. Today we could either have a shake away or a Ben's cookie. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, sis, she's Don't up for it. Sis. We can go to Hotel Chocolat and look at the Halloween chocolate, sis. <laughs> right, what Elsa, do you think you've about got that? those two seats there, that, that seat there, sorry. Yeah, I've already booked it. Okay. What did you say, Angel? Oh yeah, you love your denim, don't you, boo? Yeah. Come across this skirt, which I love, but I would probably never wear just because it wouldn't suit my body shape very much. <gasps> sis, I was just about to vlog that as well. How nice is that, sis? Very cute autumn winter pinnacle. So cute. Absolutely adore. With a white turtleneck. You know it, boo. Love it. Have you got any open knee boots yet? Yes, actually, sis. I have some from last autumn. And now I have a healed pair as well. So there you go. Really? Yeah. I need to get a healed pair. That's what I want. Sis, do you actually know what I can imagine you in? Yeah. Those. I mean, Ellie's quite these. Yeah, we like them, sis. Oh, sis, I knew you'd say that. Do you not know what I think? No. I don't know what, what crazy boots was it you had last year? No, it was other ones. You had, like, crazy boots. Oh, that was a year before. Oh. They remind me of those. Sis in our crazy boots and Kit Kat of our denim. And me with my hashtag style. Ellie pink. Everything pink and loose. Pink velvet. We're just outside of um, Krispy Kreme because we've spotted that they do a Vimto range. And the person running the shop is going to be back in five minutes, but we are just glancing through the window. I'm not feeling the Vimto, but really I really want the Halloween. How can we get Halloween donuts on Halloween, sis? Because Tesco's don't usually have them all in. Sis, we have to order them and get them yeah, delivered. So. Can you do that? No, no. Maybe. Let's find out. Sis, I want those ja I want the Frank, oh my God. I can Frankie see Frankenstein. I can see my table now. A um, huge, big Don't worry, display of Krispy Kreme Halloween donuts. That's right, sis. Think positive, not Let's negative. Go Let's go and h and come back. Sis, here's our jumper. In mustard. Oh my god, boo, look at that. Mustard. In mustard colour. Love that. I prefer ours though. Oh, sis, obviously ours is nude pink. Yeah. Are you joking? Oh, sis, look what she spotted. Maybe. She spotted a flowery dress. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Maybe a couple more jumpers, boo. And Elle made fun of me. Sis, you forget I'm a sis, 30. Let me guess what you would pair that with. Doc Martens. Like you totally work, would. Work like office dress. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> good one. Sis, I'm a fan though, aren't I? Yeah, I know, but I've got to wear these. Yes, yeah, sis, you have to wear flowery dresses. It'll be you one day. <laughs> no, it won't. You'll never see me picking up that and saying, wow. Go on, sis, be the model. Wow, like hey, you darling. are looking like a groovy girl in that hat. I like this what hat. What vibes are you feeling Sis, who wears a hat like this all the time? Sis, God knows. Pete Wicks on Anyways Essex. Oh, sis, I'm not a big Pete Wicks, Pete, Pete Wicks fan. Don't you watch Anyways Essex? Not really. Oh my God, you're missing out. I'm going to try this one on. about that colour. Sis! Okay, go on then. That's a Baker Boy hat, what you had. Yeah, a Biker Boy, isn't it? No, oh my God, sis. Oh my God. <laughs> Angels. I can't believe she just said that. I'm going to Google that in a minute. Yeah, good luck, hon. Yeah, sis, you look like an artist. Go to Kit Kat. Thanks, sis. That's a nice comment. Yeah, I like it, sis. I do like it. Do you? It's nice. I'm, I'm just not. I just think it's very different. I don't think it's very me. I do feel like a vegetable with like some sort of leaf on my head. <laughs> OMG, I can see the first Christmas light in Bath. Oh my, God, oh my goodness. I wow. spotted it way back there, boo. Oh, sorry, sis. <laughs> oh, look, they're all up there. Wow. Here at our favorite restaurant. OMG, I'm oh so excited. Oh my God, no, stop, stop. Oh my God, what? Two courses for 10 99 Monday to Thursday. Oh, wow. Oh, that is great. 10 99 Monday to Friday. Oh no, it's April 12th. Oh no, what are we gonna do? Sis. What's the time? Oh my god guys, it's shut for an hour. <laughs> and, and we, we were all ready. We were ready. We really wanted lunch at 11. We could sit down and have a bite of emails and stuff. Have a Should drink. we see what time it actually opens? Is there like a thing anywhere? 
Oh my god, literally it. hashtag annoying. Let's just sit down and have a snack. We've got, let's chill out for a bit. Let's let's get something to eat. Elle's actually treated the whole sisters <laughs> and brought a little uh, mini Les Shawpoint for us all to share. Who does that remind you of getting one tiny thing for a whole heap of people? Giles Darby. Yeah. <laughs> Our dad. If you don't know, get to know. We're about to see the TGI, so I'll forgive you. Yeah, so this is a kind little starter. Yeah. <laughs> I'll let you off, boo. Yeah. <laughs> We have made it into TGIs. We've all got our Coke floats. Oh wow, sis, what a fab boom right now. <laughs> oh my god, I'm Thanks, Angel. I know. Sis, we're in TGIs, sipping our Coke floats, listening to One Direction. And it's the best song they ever did, so I'm feeling good. It is, yeah? Yeah, literally. You don't know, oh, oh. You don't know you're beautiful. You saw what I can see. You don't know you're beautiful. That's what makes you beautiful. The garlic bread, okay. Wow, thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, so look good. at this food. Our favourite dinner. Oh my god. Literally, this is just the I best. I remember those. Yeah. This is the I best. Remember those. When they introduce us on the menu, this sauce is to die for. Oh, yeah, I could right. bathe in it. It's amazing. Okay. So, me and Lucy both got Jack Daniels and chicken. And the garlic bread. Thank there you very go. much. Do you have everything you need? Me and Katie got some cheesy garlic bread to share, and Katie got some chicken fingers. We love TGIs. Wow, angels. Okay, I've dragged us into a home decor shop because we were walking past, and there was the most beautiful. Oh Guys, my God. do you want to know the better thing, right? Oh, sis, what? You pick your sofa. No, sis, stop. No, 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 stop. <gasps> and you pick your fabric. Oh my God. Oh my actual God, sis. Baby pink velvet. <gasps> oh my God. <gasps> Wow. I'm that's how you do it. There was honestly the nicest sofa downstairs. I'll show you guys in a sec. But we've come upstairs and look at this mirror. Oh my god. I love that. I just like, actually. Yours and Con's bedroom. I love this entire look. On the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> that mirror for a mirror. Wow. <laughs> wow, is that? Not even that bad. That's either. literally not even badly no. priced. Oh my god. Oh my god, I really like that. Oh my god, I actually want that mirror now. And then sofa which we all nice. love dearly i wish i could have it in my house but there we go hello Whoa. Whoa. oh my goodness Abby. hello gorgeous guy why have you got your collar on you're looking like a very smart young man that was a lovely Whoa. Loveliest welcome home I've ever had, Herbie. Thank you very much. Have you missed me, my little boy? Hello again, everybody. Um, I am now in a much lazier attire because I had to do lots of work when we got home from Bath. But now I'm with two of my older sisters, Sophie, Maud, <laughs> and Lucy Rat Darby Carter. And we have come to the cinema to watch A Star Is Born. Um, I'm really excited about it. Our dad actually said it was as good as The Greatest Showman, and The Greatest Showman, as we all know, because we were singing it earlier, is like our favourite film. So here we are, my favourite place on the planet. I feel like I haven't been here in a really long time because me and Connor haven't been here oh, really yeah. since we got Herbie. And you all know we're Limitless Card members, so um, this is a very rare cinema trip for me. Makeup off, comfy's <laughs> on, my. Top is from Primark. I cut it more into a crop, and then my joggers are PLT. What do I own? I got to go up to the counter to get mine because I'm a limitless queen. Was it mine? No, that's okay. Thank you. What are you pigs ordering? <laughs> We're ordering the Shero. It's actually brilliant. So it's okay. okay. Popcorn. A one bag of sweets and two soft drinks. Wow. For twelve fifty. Okay, that's pretty um, good. As the ice blast is a fifty p on its thirteen. I got yeah. some giant buttons, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Thank you, and my ice blast. Thank you very much. Perfect. Yeah. Sis, it is pretty perfect, actually. Why didn't you get the big one? Well, that was a medium. I thought it was going to be like a pretty. Yes. Wait, did I get a small or a medium? I got a small. Okay, does the medium come with a lid? Yes. There you go. Would I be able to upgrade to a medium? So pour it into the medium. Yeah. I'm gonna hold. Just ice, taking a picture for ice this. Can you just run, a, run over there and see? Thanks, Sam. This is the 
Like that. Did you not portrait? No. It's a big fat hog holding it as if to say, now nah, bitch. Okay, angels, that's going to go ahead and conclude the video. Um, can I just say, A Star is Born was the best film I've ever seen in my entire life. Okay, actually, no, I have three favourite movies. First one, Wolf of Wall Street. Second one, Marley and Me. Third one, A Star is Born. They are just... Oh, fourth, Greatest Showman, obviously. Okay, they're one of my favourites. But yeah, if you haven't seen that yet, definitely go and check it out. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it was kind of kind of random i had loads of fun filming it um if you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up i really don't know kind of the reception i'm gonna get with this video because i know that it was like so all over the place um i love you guys and i will see you in the next video sunday's video is a really exciting one i basically went to home center today and spent a lot of money and there's a lot of stuff to do with the house that i need to update you on so that's what that video is gonna be love you guys and see you in the next one bye